Hi everybody, Chloe Thompson here, Onboarding and Recruiting Specialist with SNS Services Group, and this is a Paylocity walkthrough video on how to delete a time off request that you submitted. Please keep in mind that if you want to delete a request, the dates you were taking off must not have passed yet. If the date did pass and you indeed did not take that time off, you would have needed to notify your supervisor so that they could have adjusted the time for you but you are allowed to delete a pending or approved request if the dates you are taking off have not passed yet. So to delete a float or PTO request, we're gonna to go to our homepage of Paylocity, which looks like what I have on the screen now, and we're gonna scroll down until we find the time off box. Similar to how we would go and request time off, we're gonna click on the bottom right hand more icon, and we're gonna click on the option that says submit time off request. Once we're on this new page, we're automatically going to go to the time off section and we're going to find the status icon and highlight it blue. Once we're in this status section, we're then going to find the table and look to the far right hand side of it and find the delete column. So any request that you have submitted will be located here and in the delete column, whatever request you want to delete, you're going to go ahead and click the X icon. It's going to ask you if you're sure that you want to delete the time off request and you're going to click yes. And then it is as simple as that. You'll know that the time off request was deleted if you get that icon to the right hand corner of the Paylocity page that says success. If you need any additional help, please do contact HR and we'll walk you through the process.